Thanks to the chickenpox vaccine, which has been available in the United States since 1995, not as many adults and children have to suffer through the highly contagious disease. Dr. Judy Krogstag works with the littlest of patients and says the best way to avoid the chickenpox is to simply get vaccinated. Chickenpox is a viral illness, and um, it usually starts out as kind of an upper respiratory infection, um, seeming with a little runny nose, a little fever, and then um, you break out with a rash that's a kind of a blistery type rash um, all over the, your body. It's a vaccine preventable illness, but um, before the vaccine was available, it was pretty much a standard thing that that children would get at some point in their lifetime. What did you see in regards to your patients and, and these parties that we would hear about, these chicken pox uh, parties or, or group gatherings where parents would want their, you know, their child to get together with other children? Yeah, so it, there didn't used to be so much um, chicken pox parties going on because pretty much you could get it anywhere. You could go to the grocery store and get it. You could, you know, because it's an airborne um, viral transmission and um, so all you had to do was be around somebody that sneezed that had it and and you'd get it so kids would just get it routinely somebody in their class at school would get it everybody there would get it and then all their siblings would get it and it just would spread pretty rapidly and um, so there wasn't so much uh, partying going on, but um, since the vaccine, the, the parties have gotten more popular for people who choose um, not to vaccinate. Early exposure is actually not a bad idea, but vaccination is a much better idea because um, you get an exposure to a recognizable part of the, vac of the virus without getting the symptoms and the complications of actually having the infection and the misery. Anytime there's a vaccine preventable illness, we're, uh, I'm on board. Remind us of the ages as we, as we wrap up here. So the, um, the chicken pox vaccine is recommended at one year of age and then a second dose sometime before kindergarten. So in the four to six uh, range, or you can do it prior to that. Excellent, so, so get this vaccine save you and your child absolutely a absolutely and just a reminder that there is always a chicken pox party going on at your primary care doctor's office every day and it's a safer and saner party excellent <laughs> thank you very much dr crockstead thank you coming up on medwatch today a new medication to help with severe depression gets approved by the fda find out how the key ingredient has been linked to a common anesthesia drug and a healthcare hero who has served patients for more than four decades will meet this very special nurse after this.